In this video, we're gonna show you how to become a henchman and how to get the best loot in the game. Let's check it out. You gotta be possessed with the tree. The tree. Fortnite has added some really cool features in the latest update, and one of them being you can become a henchman. And why you want to become a henchman is because you want to get to these new points of interest on the map, be able to get onto the ship or the area that's designated, and then be able to move around freely, get in the doors, get in the secret loot boxes, and pretty much stock yourself up from the very beginning with all the best guns. So we're going to show you how to do this now. And for this example, we're going to head over to the yacht, which is in the top right corner of the map. Now what we want to do is we want to find a phone booth. Now these are scattered throughout the map, usually where there are henchmen. So whether it be in the agency in the middle or scattered around the map. You can find these phone booths and if actually you go to the phone booth, as shown in the beginning of our video, it will highlight with a square or if you're playing on Xbox, the X button. Simply get in and it will disguise you as a henchman. And in our example, you're going to see us come into this little island part right before the yacht land safely and then we're going to head over to the phone booth that's located and once you put your cursor on it it will start to light up simply jump in and i'm wearing a tom brady outfit here it's going to automatically disguise me as a henchman now there's a few things to know about this and this is actually shown in the video it happened coincidentally if you get shot or take any damage whatsoever, you'll lose the disguise and you'll go back to your original disguise. That's important because you'll see later in the video, we start to get in a gunfight with some of the henchmen and some of the other people that are on the, the yacht, which makes us go back to our original form and then all of a sudden we're not disguised anymore. So it's very important to know that. So we redisguise ourselves back as a henchman. Now we're going to head towards the yacht and jump on the yacht and then show you how you're able to get into these new loot boxes that scan your face. Now, previously, if I was wearing a Tom Brady helmet, it would scan my face, deny me and say, I can't get in there. I need to be a henchman. We are now a henchman so we can go on there, have it scan our face. And these loot boxes are usually loaded. You're going to get some sort of scar, some sort of purple or even blue weapon, sometimes gold weapon as well, that come out of these loot boxes. So if you can land in these areas early on, be able to fight off whoever you need to fight off and then get into these loot boxes, it's gonna benefit you in the long run, especially as the game progresses. Now, the next thing we wanna show you is what happens when you shoot a henchman that's actually on board. And in this video, you're gonna see, I actually shot a henchman because I thought it was someone disguised as a henchman. It actually wasn't. So what happens when you shoot a henchman automatically you go back to your regular disguise and then the henchman or any other turrets or whatever it is is going to target right onto you and it's an absolute free for all so here you can see i'm hiding behind walls i'm trying to get away from all of this all because i shot one bullet at the henchman so be aware of that that if you're trying to move stealthily on the yacht or whatever the point of interest is you try not to shoot and you essentially act natural that way you can keep your disguise And the last and final point that we want to make is that any damage taken by the storm will automatically strip you of your henchman costume. Now you're going to see here, I spent way too long on the yacht. I was collecting all the loot. I was trying to get into the vault. So I was looking around all in the yacht to try to find the key card to get into the vault. And the storm hit me and took away my henchman outfit. It's important to know that if you are in the storm and you do lose your outfit, you may lose some time trying to find those loot boxes. So keep in mind, if you can land there, and you are away from the storm, try to maneuver as fast as possible to get those loot boxes and gather all that loot to get back into the storm. Because these areas and points of interest are usually on the outside of the map and you usually have to travel a long way to get back to the center of the circle. So let us know how you guys use the henchman costume to get the loot early on in the comments below. And we're going to let this video run. That way you're able to see what's behind the vault and what's actually in the vault if you still don't know what's behind the door here. So we're going to let this run and we'll see you guys next time.